Hello everybody, it's a Thorm and we're back in Grounded. Today's episode we're going to be uh, deciding to explore the map a little. So I decided I left this whole right side kind of open. So once it hits daytime we're going to head over here and start exploring. I've been kind of avoiding it because I know there's stink bugs, but I recently got a little lucky. If you've uh, been following my previous episodes, you know that uh, the orb weavers and the stink bugs just right on the other side over here just love to wage war on each other and this whole time the stink bugs been winning it's been pretty victorious but i was walking by earlier while just collecting grass and stuff and i watched it get owned by a group of orbeez and i was lucky enough to run in and get out with my life to get some stink bug parts and that's what i've been waiting on so that way i can build us this gas mask right here needs those stink bug parts, and I was having a hard time getting a hold of them because I was scared of how strong those guys are. I watched one three-shot an orb weaver, just for reference on woe difficulty. So, I'm going to go ahead and grab the stuff together, we're going to build that, and we're going to take it with us, and we'll be heading out. Uh, at daylight, of course. I'm not going to head out at night. I'm not a mad lad. I also need to check my gear. I should probably repair these. So we're going to take care of that, and then I will see you in the morning. Okay, before we finish everything and start heading out, we're going to go ahead and analyze the parts we got. Alright, so we didn't get anything for Stink Gland. How about the part? Oh, learned how to make an insect hammer. We're going to look at that in a second. Let's analyze a thistle. Spike strip. Ooh. Okay, okay. Let's look at both of those really fast. So tools. It's not in tools. Right? Gas arrow. Oh, so we did learn something by picking up the gas sack. Ooh, we'll have to try that. Spike trap. Hmm. That's good to know. Good to know. <laughs> Berry chair. How do I craft the insect hammer? Maybe I have to be at a... Uh, Actual workbench. Ah, insect hammer. Capable hammer made of durable bug parts that are much stronger than the pebble hammer. Oh, this is the rank two hammer. Okay, boiling gland. Ooh. So I'm gonna have to kill some bombardier beetles soon if I wanna make that better hammer. Okay, let's head home. We're gonna go ahead and drop some stuff off, pick up some water, and then we will head on out. All right, here we go. So since we're gonna be exploring out this way, um, we're gonna have to keep our eyes open for orb weavers, of course, but also stink bugs. Um, if we can find one before it charges us, we'll put on our gas mask and we will have a go at it and see if we can survive. Might not go well for me. As we've seen, they are pretty strong foes. Okay. Okay, so there's an analyzer here, which is nice. Let's walk into this. Stink bug. Okay, okay. Let's do it. Uh, a little safer now. Let's see. Oh, there's two here. I only want one. Yeah, uh, I don't want to try and three. 
guys are insane. I didn't know they traveled in packs. What kind of worst timeline is this? Okay. So maybe... Maybe we wait a second, because... I don't want to patrol and fight three of these things. Like, I'm definitely down to fight one. And I think... I think I can take it with an ant club. But I guess we're gonna find out. No, he's heading off to the others, so we're gonna we're gonna ignore that one for now, and we're gonna explore. So let's put our mobile helmet back on. Okay. So water hose. Gnats. You know what? I was needing gnats, and I was kind of getting frustrated because it felt like there were no gnats around me. I wish I knew they were just right here. <gasps> oh, look, a bombardier beetle. Maybe we'll fight one of those. And there's a spider around here. Oh, two orb weavers. <gasps> maybe, maybe I can get them to do the work for me. Hey, Bombardier. Come here. Yeah. Both of you. Hi. Come on, Nat. You know you want to. Okay, I was kind of hoping I can lure the spider to the Bombardier and then they would fight. And I could just steal it. Yeah, there we go. Come on, Bombardier. Just a little closer. Alright, let's see if I can get either line of sight. And we can cheese this. Oh, it doesn't look like they fight. Alright, maybe I just have to do it myself. Right. We're gonna We're gonna try this. Oh, oh no. Why is everything in groups? Seems like I need a friend. <laughs> um that's a lot of nets. Okay, so they shoot. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, let's... We'll, we'll come back at you in a bit. You took half my health in one, one mistake. That's uh... That was a learning lesson for me. Okay, so we, we gotta come at the bombardier beetles with different armor or something, cause uh... It's gonna whoop my butt. Filtration tablets needed. Maybe I should get a bow so I can shoot them since they like to shoot. Okay, okay. Let's see. Anything over here? Just some more water. Oh look, larva above ground. You know what? I really want to kill that. <laughs> I really want to kill that bombardier. Because I know I need it. It's just unfortunate that I can't lure other things into it.
It's the standoff of a century. Oh, come on. No, no, no. Come back. Wait, why? You don't need your friend. Fight me. Yeah, that's right. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Run. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, you definitely don't need your friend. I don't know why you're such a coward. You, you could destroy me. Oh. Okay. So, I don't think... I don't think we're gonna fight the Bombardier. We're gonna have to come back with a better strategy. Much better strategy, or maybe some better armor. So, I think instead, we're gonna keep exploring. We can find a stink bug, we'll, we'll, tr <laughs> we'll try a stink bug, I don't know it's gonna go much better than that. Okay, so I know better than to get trapped by the acid on a bombardier. There's a stink bug. That should keep me safe. Right. Mm, safe fur. Why are there two? Is that one dead? Nope. Nope. <laughs> Think again. Okay, so, so I was right last time to assume that they're very strong. That that one shot me. Oh man. Alright. Let's go let's go get my stuff. Okay. So I think one of the little things I learned from just, just that little fight right there. I think what I should have done is I should have practice my blocking better because obviously if I don't block that thing I'm dead that's that's a given um, secondly I should probably take my swings while it's doing the gas attack because I don't know if you saw I got like good two three swings in on there I was really hoping to swing for its head and knock it off and oh man am I gonna be able to even get to my body Stink bugs aggro from really far away. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, we're just gonna we're gonna keep running. Hope they de aggro. Good, good, good. This gives me a chance, gives me a chance. Take all. Okay. Let's check my gear. Alright, alright, not too bad. Huh, maybe... Maybe I should look into getting the bow, because maybe it would be better on the... bigger creatures to be able to alternate between fighting them with a club and fighting them with a bow. Might be something I should look into that might make my life a little bit easier. Okay, so there's larva. So, we're, we're not going to go round two on the stink bug. We have learned that the two beetles, or bugs, I guess the bombardier beetle and the stink bug are just too much for me right now. Need to get a little bit more preparedness. Um, so instead, I'm kind of just exploring this lake area. I kind of want to cut across, so I think I'm going to do that. Or try to.
I don't know what that thing is, but I don't want to fight it. So that's all. This looks like this area wouldn't be water. I was assuming that was land. Oh, that was land. I just cut across it all funky. Uh, uh, I'm going to go this way. Even though I'm pretty sure that means I'm about to have to fight a bunch of larvae. On the plus side, we now know where to get a bunch of clay. What was that? Sing me the song of your people. Dang, this place is uh, mat infested. I don't even think they can hurt me. Okay. <gasps> oh, hey. <gasps> Wait a second. Reptilian Sentinel. found <laughs> we found a nice little monument there I like that that was really cute let's see did I have a quest for that no I just got the grave robbery one okay we'll have to figure that one out later and I think we pretty much explored you know what? I'm gonna head over that way really quick just to see what's this way before we head home. So I'm sure there's something over here that will pique my interest. So, we got the bird bath. Which is nice. We'll have to explore that in another episode. We'll just... At some point we'll do like a whole series probably on that hedge because that thing looks like there's a lot to go on in there. Or maybe not a whole series, but you know, a whole episode and everything. Yeah, so I'm not going to explore more that way. We're going to walk along this way and see, uh, see where we get. Huh. Okay, so there's a spider nearby. Seems like our next big goal, aside from finding that burgle chip and continuing through the story, is definitely going to be to prepare myself to take down those bigger bugs. That and a wolf spider. We're going to have to kill a wolf spider sometime soon. Now, now we know where one lives. I know there's at least two that are also in the oak tree, but I haven't seen them in probably four or five days. I don't know if they're just, you know, patrolling or if I just 
missed something along the way, but I haven't seen them in a while. Oh, I didn't know this existed. Oh, never mind. Can't even use it properly. What's that? Oh, how are you going to put a stick there and then have it clip into the log like that? Get me on the stick. Yeah, that's, that's silly. That would have been a nice way over. Let's go this way. Okay. Oh. Oh, man. That skyrocketed my heart rate. The second he hit me, I my, my heart skipped a beat. I thought I got hit by an orb weaver. And then when I saw no damage. Ooh. to make. Got some gnat fuzz to put away. And some stone to put away. Really need to organize my junk. In fact, I think that's what I will do right now while I wait for it to hit nighttime. Alright, we're going to head on over to our main man, Burkle. We're going to see if he's got any new quests for us today. See if there's anything interesting. Because we definitely can't do anything about those stink bugs or bombardiers just yet. Nice Alright, so he wants me to make two armor glue. Cool, cool. Chips with jungle. Your prize awaits deep in the leafy jungle inside an overgrown temple, reachable only by branch and vine, resting alongside the metal arm of the temple's once beating heart. Hmm. So I can only get there. You know what? I'm gonna guess that last one is probably in the hedge. That'd be my guess. Um, at least that seems like a likely location. All right, so just to double check, the two we've got, cause I'm not worried about the armor glue one. We can do that one easy. Uh, let's see, grave robbery. So in that anthill to the west, I'm gonna guess it's an anthill, because they said through a tunnel of red. Hmm, interesting. that's going to be it for this one. So if you found it informative or got a laugh watching me get my butt kicked by uh, the big bad bugs, go ahead and toss me a like. It really helps me out. And uh, if you wouldn't mind, subscribe if you want to see more. See you around in the next one.